increasingly important word in the atomic and hydrogen age. The facts from federal civil defense tell us that fallout could hurt you, might even kill you. Well, what about it, mister? What is this fallout stuff? Fallout is nothing more than particles of matter in the air made radioactive by nuclear explosions. Sooner or later, however, they settle to Earth. This is fallout. And it can be very dangerous if you don't know what to do about it. Well, do you know what to do about it, Grandpa? Not yet, young man, but I will. There are four major characteristics of an A-bomb or H-bomb explosion. They are blast, heat, initial radiation, and residual radiation. All this clear so far, sister? Sure, but you've talked about fallout from enemy bombing. Our government very carefully tests only small nuclear devices in the United States. So these are the facts that should reassure and encourage you. Be ready to assist in defense preparations in your community if your help is needed. For fallout is only one fallout, one of them, fallout, one. You're alive! Thanks. The whole vault's doing pretty well. They've got the place in much better shape than when you left. Here, take this. It's not fair, I know. But it's the way it is. I know Amata still misses you. Oh, I will. Yeah, I guess I should be getting back. A new quest has been added.
Radio signal detected. Look, stay out of this. What? What kind of shit is that? Why don't you mind your own business? No one talks that way about Wally Mac. Nice try, butt wipe. Run along, kid, before I decide you're a problem. Evening. Hey, welcome back. It's really good to see you again. Honestly, we couldn't have done it without your help. Outside interference, as they called it. Amada has been just amazing, but still, you were the catalyst for change. Definitely. We've established contact with Megaton and Rivet City. We are sending representatives to some of the larger towns and villages. Now that the future is looking brighter, attitudes are more positive. She's worked tirelessly getting everything cleaned up and repaired. A few troublemakers had to leave. She launched a morale boosting project. Now you see new things popping up, like that poster over there. Oh, sorry, she's away on a mission. Supervisor Gomez is her second in command. I believe he'd like to talk to you. People have had a chance now, to think about what you did for us. And tales of your exploits in the wasteland have been filtering into us. Now you've become a bit of a hero. I'm not joking. Listening to the radio, I've heard how Three Dog speaks of you. Can you believe what they've started calling you? Lone Wanderer, like some character in a comic. Don't worry about Mr. Tough Guy. He might not like you much, but he knows you are important to us. Yes, of course. Supervisor Gomez has asked to see you. And if I know Amada, you have a little something waiting for you in your old place. Take care of yourself. Hello. Just a bit of trading with Christine. As honest as the day is long. It was nice meeting you. Make it quick. Is there any better life? Thanks for your help. We'll take any we can get. It's good to see you back. You should ask him. Don't you believe the rumors? It doesn't work like that. We're just security. Good luck.
I never thought you'd be back. Well, all right then. Not bad. Not bad. Stop, you're embarrassing me. But thank you. Dinner was, well, um, I was able to finish it. I hate guns. Besides, the pen is mightier than the sword, or the assault rifle. Hey, that's what I'm here for. Yes, and Amata can come over after you clean your room. Now move! This place is disgusting.
You made it. That's great. Amada is away, setting up new trade contacts. When she sent for you, we had no way to know how long it would take her message to reach you. She wanted a clearly recognized lieutenant, so Amada came up with the title. Thank you. Since the death of Jonas, and your father's departure, we've had no doctor. Andy was a disaster. We activated his medical procedures, but the results were awful. We have heard of a skilled physician in Rivet City, who wants to relocate, right away. We cannot lose this opportunity. Exactly. You've proven that you can survive the toughest challenges. And I trust you, completely. Doctors are in high demand. Mercs or raiders might snatch him on the way. Be vigilant. Excellent. You have A your father's spirit. Completed. James would be proud. Meet Dr. Thomas Hansen at Rivet City and bring him here as quickly and safely as you are able. A new quest has been added. Hey. message. hope true i just wish we knew who we could trust we still have friends gloria would not have lied yeah she seemed legit but something might have happened no matter i will find a way out of this mess thomas whatever the challenge you will succeed you always do ah there you are welcome hello light on Hello, I'm Thomas Hansen, and this is my assistant, Alice. Um, you're the entire escort from Vault 101? Just you? I thought there would be more, you know, like a real escort. Hmm, if you say so. We didn't find what we were looking for. Leave it at that. Not yet. We were attacked, and my medical case was taken. We cannot leave without it. You're gonna have to recover it. Well, of course I know where it is. Some Talon mercenaries have it in an underground base. I've been observing them. I'll mark the location for you. I'm a doctor, damn it, Not a gunslinger. You have to handle this on your own. Come here. I need to examine your ears. Because you obviously weren't hearing what I was telling you. Go to the Talon underground base I marked for you and recover my medical case. See you later. Yeah, Bell's gonna have to replace some tape. Hey, kids. have you noticed that Enclave Radio is off the air? From the lower deck. Remember that? Did you hear about the fight in a muddy rudder last night? night? But that's what happened to it. Thank God. That was...
such an annoying broadcast. Bat system activated. Selected. Bat system off. City's got all kinds of good camps. I'll good try to that. see you. Bat system activated. Bat system off. Message. Light off. Stealth mode activated. <laughs> Message. Message. Unknown explosive successfully disarmed. Unknown explosive successfully disarmed. Message. Message.
light on message 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 Message. Yes. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, kid. Just testing out a new uh, inhalant. I love it when a plan comes together. What are you complaining about? You're alive, aren't you? Hmm, the case seems a little light. Did you open it? I appreciate the honesty. No matter, I suppose there are carrying charges. Look, we all have stuff in our past we'd like to leave behind. But don't make hasty conclusions. I don't know his name. I know his kind. You know about that, do you? Yeah, from up north, in the Commonwealth. Beep, beep, that does not compute. Yeah, you got me. Idiot. What did I say about hasty conclusions? Excuse me, what Thomas is saying, in his unique way, is the time Grayson. From your polite words, I think you might have heard of us before. The Institute will not trouble me there. And the Vault's technology is of interest to me. No. Don't tell me. If that person has found a safe refuge at Rivet City, keep that secret. Now that my identity is known, I cannot stay here. That is not an option for me. Leave it at that. Vault 101 will provide an excellent hideaway. See you later. So, genius. You got it all figured out now? They gave them all code names, usually based on one of their creators. Dr. Grayson led the team that built Alice. She chose the name after a pre-war story of a girl who found herself in a land full of crazy people. 
My training is in medicine and my specialty is chemistry. I only worked indirectly with the synthetics team. Most of the synthetics, they're not much more than machines. Sometimes one just clicks and starts to really think and feel with true self-awareness. When Alice developed free will, I helped her escape. When Alice became self-aware, when I talked to her, I knew she was special. I couldn't let her stay in that place. That organization's been compromised. I can't take a chance with them, so I have to trust you. God help me. Correct. With those spares, she'll outlive us all. I couldn't leave without them, or my formulas. If that vault of yours has a decent chemistry lab, I'll be able to show you something really special. I sure can, thank you. We didn't have a replacement for this component. Now we do. That's disgusting. Alice is like a daughter to me. If anyone shows her anything less than complete respect, I'll teach him the true meaning of pain. Got it? Alice and I will follow you. I picked up something more suitable for us to wear for traveling. Message. People here talked about him. James, wasn't it? He gave up his research to take someone dear to him to safety in Vault 101. Now we follow in his footsteps. See you later. It's a pleasure to meet you at last. Bye. message. We need to keep moving. See you later. I always wondered what these vaults were like. This one's in pretty good shape. Very true. Remarkably good. I'd like to see the clinic's equipment. Well done. Thank you for guiding us here safely. Here's a little something for you. A quest is message. completed.
Hi. Excellent job. I knew you were the right person for this. Thank you. Farewell. Hi. Message. Message. It's you and me now, okay? You and me. But that's fine. So long as we've got each other, that's all that matters. Not so bad, huh? A bit chilly, maybe, but we'll get used to that. A few decorations, some donated toys, and this place will feel just like home. Hello. I got it from Stanley. It's very useful. All my research data will go into it. The technology is experimental. If you are willing to take your chances with this model, at least it hasn't exploded yet. I have a spare. Please accept it as a token of friendship. TMI, too much information? Has anyone told you that you share too much? Bye. <coughs> Sorry, kid. Just testing out a new uh, inhalant. Yeah, he's outfitted us with Pip Boys, and I've whipped up something special for his headaches. They're not addictive, and the effects stack with commonly used chems. So you can use them alone for small, safe boost, or in combination with powerful chems to enhance their effect. 
Goodbye. Hi there. heard he has a card game going since they don't play for caps that's okay with me you're right I'm becoming concerned because Amata is late getting back from her mission correct I asked her not to go herself but she insisted can you go check to see if she's okay Tim Henderson represents us in town. He watches for A news new and gathers added. information. You should talk to him. Actually, yeah. Alice wants to speak to you. She's very thankful for finding a home here, and she'd like to show her appreciation. For your search, Alice would like to assist. Message. Hello. Correct. I want to help the Overseer, and I am stronger than I look. You won't regret it. Private Alice, at your service. I'm ready. See you later. Goodness gracious! Seems like you've been gone forever. Much better lately, thanks for asking. Very kind of you to say so. Thank you. Well, I feel a lot safer now, that's for sure. Worthy of respect. Don't ever lose your gift to speaking your mind so directly. Go on now. I'm sure you've had quite enough old lady chit-chat. It's good to see you again. Not bad. Not bad. Stop. You're embarrassing me. But thank you. Goodbye.
What's the big idea? message. Hi there. They wanted a representative in town to keep up with the news. Well, it's pretty nice to be away from my wife Donna. She's back there in the vault. Gomez told me to keep a low profile outside. Stay quiet and don't attract attention. Of course. I wrote it all down for you. Take this. Goodbye. Junk is my business. Hey there. Message.
message. begin this episode of the adventures of Captain Cosmos, we've got a message from the fine folks at Pulaski Preservation Services, purveyors of products there when you actually need them. Seems there's been a lot of talk these days about vault life, but not all of us have the luxury to spend so much on something that, frankly, we may not actually need. Unlike those other guys, the sensible folks at Pulaski Preservation Services have created an affordable line of personal protection products to make sure no one gets left behind. Personal protection, there when you actually need it. Remember, that's Pulaski Preservation Shelters, simply there when you actually need them. Exact change only. And now on to our show, The Adventures of Captain Cosmos, co-starring Jangles, the Moon Monkey. Thank you. 